And anything that I have in a company, a company, that's that sangria. An accompanying, an accompany, e ing, an accompanying. Okay, let's stop. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Life with Love. This is your girl Love, and I am back with a Mother's Day video. It is May, guys. It is May. The first week of May. The week where everybody wants to do 12 million things for you, take you everywhere, and all you want to do, all you want to do is get 24 hours to yourself without anybody asking you for anything, without anybody being hungry, without anybody needing you for anything, without any other voice in your head but yours and God. Like, I don't know why people don't understand that. I don't want to cook. I honestly don't want you to cook for me. Give me a spa day. Give me a day at the beach. Give me a day in a hotel give me a day of rest you being in my face on mother's day might not be what i want and that's usually how we all feel but we endure anyway don't we moms so kudos to you happy mother's day everybody and i hope you get what you want i really hope you get what you want so i wanted to come on and give you a list of mother's day fragrances that you might want to add to your list if you don't have any of them you probably have one or two of them but I wanted to just give you some suggestions that you can send to send the links to your children via text message so that they already um, have a running start in some on some things that you like I have young kids I have a 19 and a 12 year old and let's just say that sometimes the gifts are not I'm just they're always like you're so hard to buy for you have everything you're so hard if you study me or you hear me talk about things, I promise I don't have everything. I like gadgets in the kitchen. I love perfume. I love sunnies. Like, how hard am I to buy for? Do you just think that I have enough of everything and so you don't want to add to my collection? That's all you got to say. You don't want to add to my collection. But you're going to add. You're going to add. So I sent my kids a couple of fragrances that I didn't put in here, but older fragrances because they're not going to pay what mommy pays but i did send them um a couple of fragrances that i need to restock on that i haven't had in a while and they can either go to burlington ross marshall's and grab them or i sent them links on online they both have credit cards so they can just order it like they can just go ahead and order me something i'm just i'm just saying i'm trying to give them a little nudge just a little nudge go ahead and get it done get mommy something good please please so with that said i have about Three, six, nine, ten. I have eleven. Is it eleven? Three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I have twelve. Thirteen. Okay. Apparently, I can't count. Girl, let's try it again. Let me. Let's talk about how we celebrate Mother's Day. We're celebrating this Mother's Day with a little calorie booster. <laughs> This is made with elderflower, pear, lemon, apple, pineapple, and white grape. Boom! This is a great sangria. <laughs> okay. Let's get it done. That's why the girl can't count. But we have three, six, nine, twelve. We have twelve fragrances. See, I have little samples in there. So that's what's, that's what's killing it. Also, I know you guys probably cannot see my whole top. But this cute little number that I have on is over on the Amore Chic page. If you guys do not know, over on lovedavis.com. If you open up the menu and go to Amore Chic, that is my online boutique. I've been online boutiquing since I since 2021. I went from regular boutique into online. And so generally, if there is something I'm selling, I am letting you know this is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite lightweight um, off-the-shoulder tops, just so you know. Okay, and it's by one of my favorite brands, P.O.L. They make really good casual, sexy... Off the, they just make really good casual sexy clothes like you can just put this on with white with white jeans grab a boot a booty a sandal you want to know how to put 50 pairs of shoes on a shelf welcome to my world y'all just don't know all right so i'm gonna start anything i mentioned i'm gonna put a list in the description box any any body creams that i have that match any of these i'm going to go ahead and mention them i'm not going to show them and i will put the links in the description box below uh, if you guys do not know, I have a Love Home and a Love Beauty brand, which the home does the candles, the beauty does the body creams, and I have another product I'm going to bring out later this year. So I'm going to start with number one. Number one is going to be the Diva Dawn, and that is going to be Lancome's La Vie Belle. 
I am not going to go through the fragrance notes. This, as you can see, I'm, I need a new bottle and I'm gonna need a bigger bottle because she went through this quick. So this is a year in and I would, had I not started doing um, like the video thing, if I had I not started back up on YouTube doing fragrance videos and then kind of building up my collection again, this would be gone. So I've used it, but this is my first um, fragrance. If your mom does not have La Vie Belle, get it. You will not go wrong. It is a beautiful, smooth, loving, sexy. All moms want to be sexy. We want to be sexy no matter what we have on, what, what, what we're doing, whether or not we're at the doctor's, whether or not we're at um, Chuck E. Cheese. We want to do something, okay? We want to smell sexy. We want to be sexy all the time. So these are fragrances that I picked that I, I thought would get us in that mood, okay? As a mother, I'm telling you, these are these are it. So I will put the uh, the body cream that I have with this here. So number one is La Vie et Belle. Number two is probably one that you like. You want me to get my mom that? Hell yes. <laughs> Dolce & Gabbana's Light Blue or Light Blue Intense. If I had to choose between the two, I would get the Light Blue Intense first. Moms like stronger scents. And this one is good, but the, the Intense is my favorite. I don't have it yet. I'm working on it. I got this one at a major discount, but the, the, oh, it smells so good. This is the best citrus, sexiest fragrance, period. Like, absolutely, period. Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue is going to be number two, my number two, or get the intense version. You will not go wrong, okay? Give this to grandma. Let me tell you something. For all my white diamond lovers out there, get your grandma or your mother this i have one friend who still wears white diamond i don't i can't change i could not bring her over from the dark side i can't get the light blue intense for for her just get it just get it and drop it in the bottom of her church purse so that it changes it finally smells like something else other than peppermints and white diamond okay that's all i'm gonna say number three is one of my cheapies but still a really good um, scent, it reminds me of, um, YSL Mon Paris, but this is Sophia by Sophia Vergara. She also has Love by Sophia Vergara that I heard was extremely good. But if you want a nice, subtle scent and you're on a budget, let's not be ashamed of being on a budget. It's COVID, it's a pandemic, your funds might not look right, the, the stimulus check might be gone. Whatever it is, go ahead and grab this you can find this at burlington ross tj maxx or marshall's all the time all right so that is sophia by sophia vangara if you have ever smelled ysl mon paris this is a lighter version of that this is definitely worth it you can do this flowers and something else like a purse you know we love a good new purse love a good new purse that's what we can do so that's going to be number three number four number four and I have a, how many mils is this? What, how, what ounces? What is this? Oh, uh, this is 10 mil, right. So this is a 10 mil. This is Chloe um, Rose Tangerine. I wanted to add two rose fragrances. This is the Fresh Clean Rose Fragrance that I love. I love. I love this rose fragrance. Like this is, I'm trying to figure out what I want to spray on. Because I have, I, I'm trying to figure out what I want to spray on me today. You know what, let's do, let's do rose. Let's get it, girl. Ooh. Y'all see me glistening? This rose is bomb. All right? It is bomb. So this is Chloe Rose. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I threw that at y'all. This is Chloe Rose Tangerine. That is my number four. Let's do <laughs> my number five. So my number five, I have a sample of. I've not hit the buy, um button yet but i will and that is going to be you're not even going to be able to read it but this is chanel chance un tondre i have not hit the buy button yet i will soon how much do i have left this is how much i have left of mine i only had one mil so it probably came to like right here but that's what i have i have one wear. this is probably two wares i have two wares left of this and had i not sprayed that chloe that chloe is bomb first of all look at look look oh okay okay you see i'm glistening like i just came out the, the fresh out of the shower that and it smell good y'all that chloe rose is bomb rose tangerine all right so that is going to be next on my list you know i lose count a lot what number is that one two three four five this is going to be number six 
Number six is going to be Twilly, but not the original Eau de Parfum. This is the Eau Pauvoui, okay? Get the Eau Pauvoui. It is so much better than the first one. It's a little bit sweeter without that really stark... Um, what's in that? Is it is it cardamom? It has a spice. It's a spice in that first one. I believe it's cardamom, if I'm not mistaken. But this one has a little bit more sweetness to it. So, we love this. And as soon as this... Uh, as soon as this is empty, and I've used quite a bit because this was full. Look how much I've used. Um, as soon as this is empty, I will grab a bottle. So I will definitely be adding this to my collection. So this is Twilly uh, by Hermes. And this is Eau Pauvoui. So Twilly by Hermes. Eau Pauvoui with Eau de Parfum is where you want to go for this one here. Okay? To choose between the two. You want to go with the one that's more sweeter. And that is Eau Pauvoui. I think I said that right. All right, up next, which one do we want to do? I'm gonna do this one because it is an outlier. So this is Banana Republic's Oud Mosaic. Let me say, let me tell you why I added this. An oud, so most women won't grab an oud unless you are an oud lover or you know an oud lover. And so if you wanna do an introduction to a fragrance that your mom might like that is completely out of the ordinary, this is probably the less intoxicating oud. When I say intoxicating, oud can be so overwhelming, it literally makes you feel intoxicated because it's, it, it, it comes in so deep and heavy and you feel like you're breathing it in deep. It almost intoxifies your body. This oud is sexy, a little strong, but playful and just... It's just a good oud for a beginner. This is a good beginner oud. So this is going to be Banana Republic's Oud Mosaic. If you can't find it online, search all of the Banana um, <laughs> Search all of the Burlingtons. You will definitely find it. So this oud Mosaic is a great beginner oud for a woman who would like a signature scent, who likes something very strong and unisex. Some mothers like very strong fragrances. This is a perfect oud for them. And then... Let's do one of my faves. This is Carolina Herrera's um, Good Girl Leisure. I don't know if it's Leisure or Leisurey. I want to say it's Leisure, and that's why I'm going to say it. So this is Leisure. Leisure is a little bit more um, everyday, softer, sexier than the regular Good Girl. So if she's already got Good Girl, go ahead and get her Leisure. If she doesn't have Good Girl at all, this one's going to be a little bit more, to me, um, impactful for Mother's Day because it's a little bit more of a individual scent. So Good Girl Leisure is going to be my next, um, on my list next. I'm trying to figure out what size this is. This is by Carolina Herrera. Anyway, it looks so much bigger in my hand than it is, but this is, I think that this is 100 mil. So this is a three point something else. All right, up next is going to be Ariana Grande's Cloud. So because we all love, of course, Baccarat Rouge 540, because I, you know, if you don't know this on the channel, I've added Baccarat Rouge 540 to my body cream and candle line. This is going to be a really, really, really good fragrance. This is what I want you to do, though. You're, I would not give it to mom packaged the way that it is. So this is the one ounce. I would go ahead and get her the 3.3 ounce or the 3.4 ounce bottle. It is worth all the money you're going to pay for it, which is probably $40, $45. But I want you to take it out the packaging. I want you to take it out the cloud. So it comes sitting... Um, it comes set in this, in this cloud that's way too juvenile. And the boxing is way too juvenile. It's not... Um, adult sexy at all so you want to try to put this in something else and I don't know how you package something that's new that's not in a box but I would package it with flowers maybe put it inside the bouquet something a little different do not give it to mom on just on Mother's Day in that packaging it is way too juvenile and it looks cheap but it is such a powerful strong fragrance so that is going to be Ariana Grande's cloud if you want to accompany it accompany it with my body cream and my and a candle, I would do that as well. This is such a goodie. It's a good cheapie. A good cheapie. All right, we're down to the last three fragrances, right? That means that this is number 10. It's going to be Marc Jacobs Perfect. I love it. I love it. It's such a good everyday. 
your mom gonna she gonna burn the whole bottle up. She gonna burn the whole bottle up, bottle up. It is smooth, fruity, ugh, it's just <sighs> floral. It is bomb. It's just such a good everyday, fresh, clean, impactful fragrance. It really, really is. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Again, I'll link the body cream to this as well. But this is such a goodie. If you in the bottle is cute, like it's gonna come in a cute little box. It's gonna come. The packaging on it is cute. If you can get the gift set, go ahead and get it a gift set. However, the lotion inside the gift kit set is probably one of the runniest lotions I've ever, ever, ever experienced in my life. Like super duper duper runny. All right. So I would not if you can get like the fragrance and maybe a roller ball or a travel set so she can keep one of her purse. That's what I would do. But don't get the lotion the lotion is w the worst which is the worst and if i of course I, I i should have done a comparison between like their lotion and my lotion and maybe i will maybe i'll do a video on a comparison of the body cream that i make in the lotion the designer lotion that's so much more their lotion is literally the runniest i've ever 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 seen and the second one would be balenciaga's b all right so that is going to be um mark jacobs perfect and then number 11 is going to be one of my favorite roses. And that is by Montal Paris. And this is Rose Elixir. Listen. Listen, listen, listen. Let me show you the juice. I've been really trying not to wear this a lot because I really don't want to buy the bottle yet. But this is what it this is what the juice looks like. I have not worn it but like three or four times. You don't need to heavy spray it. It is a goodie. It's a great rose fragrance. Uh, Montel bottles are metallic and they're tall. And they make such a good presentation if you want to do it with a bouquet of flowers. That would be really, really, really cute. So Montel Pot Paris rose elixir if you're new to that brand if you don't know anything about that brand this would be a great first fragrance to purchase okay and then last but not least let me take her out the box last but not least let me take it out the box i haven't even taken it out the box yet i still have i have one more wear left of one or two more wears left of the sample which is why i have not taken it out but this is killian's after sunset <sighs> This is how it comes open. This is the top guide. This is super duper duper sexy. You gonna have to figure out how to get your hands on this. Probably eBay. Um, because this is sold out. But I'm gonna put it in here anyway. Because it's it's not sold out everywhere. You can still find a couple of them. I'm probably gonna buy a backup bottle really, 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 really soon. But this is Killian's... <laughs> um after sunset it is so super duper bit good oh my god um this has black carrot lychee and rose those are the three main notes of this fragrance and it's just bomb the black current it's just bomb i usually love black current and fragrances this is super duper duper bomb and that is it for me let me pull this out because i'm probably gonna do a thumbnail with this in it and that is it guys for my mother's day fragrances here is the tray. <laughs> if you guys don't know, that is it for me. Um, I wanted to give something that was a little bit more cost effective and friendly, especially since it's a pandemic and you can stretch your money a little bit further. We all love a little bit of candy. I love Seize Candy. Seize Candy has the best... Why am I saying this? Like my kids watch my, 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 um, my videos, but Seize Candy has the best... Um, peanut brittle oh my god it is the best just fyi for anybody that's listening sees candy is it so that is it for me i will see you guys in another video i hope you have an amazing mother's day please leave a comment below let me know what you guys got for mother's day if you got one of these fragrances and uh just let me know how it went until next time guys ciao